to Ricarte's Crossing. Okay, with New Zealand Naturally Tarot with, and the Songs of My Heart and the Warua Intuitive Guidance Cards, we're going to do have a look at the week ahead. So let's have a look and see what the week ahead is all about. What does the what does the week ahead hold for us as a collective? Okay, so let's do one, two, three, four, whoops, five and six. Right, so let's have a look and see what this week ahead is for us. So, let's have a look. Okay, this week we've got Night of Trees. So there's definitely some swift movement happening. Um, definitely things happening quite quickly. There could be some hesitation though mentally even though there's a physical movement. We do have some chaos things that need to sort of stay calm. Two of coins. Oh, so this is, I feel like you're juggling a lot of stuff going on. That's why I feel like it's quite chaotic could be this week could be a lot of chaos going on a lot of stuff being juggled trying to find your priorities what's important that's why things feel quite intense with the night of trees I'm sort of getting a very intense when I sort of when I was thinking about things being quick I do felt I do feel as though things are happening in a bit of a chaotic way so things are happening intensely passion creativity Okay, with the three of peaks. Oh, heartbroken. Betrayal. It could be a very challenging week. Could be a little bit challenging at the moment. Things feel a bit chaotic, so you might be feeling a little bit overwhelmed by it all. And so you need to find a way to um, choose how you react to the situation. Try and stay as calm and as relaxed as you can. Try and find a, set, a serenity within yourself. I think that's very important. It does feel like everything's very chaotic. It's very challenging. There could be some disappointments, some heartbreaks. And so you've got to find a way to get yourself calm and relaxed. So you can choose to react in a different way. Trying to find the solution to the issues. I do feel like you are looking for... Um, opportunities to arise you're looking for the um, things to sort of turn out right that's what I want to say here so you need to look at what are you actually so what are you holding on to what do you actually need to let go of? It feels like you're holding on to something very tightly and there might be something that you actually need to let go of because of the week being so, so chaotic. So it's important that you choose a sense of calmness, a sense of relaxation. Um, I know things are quite challenging. This is going to be quite a challenging week. It feels very intense, chaos. Trying to find your priorities out of all the chaos and stuff going on. I think it's going to be quite difficult for you to try to bring things into a karma energy okay so let's have a look at the warua let's choose three cards for the week ahead one Tapito Marikiri and Ha Okay, so let's have a look see what the message is 
four. That's right, ancient, ancient knowledge, ancient teachings, the past. So it does feel like you're leaving behind the past, acknowledging the past could be really important. So let's have a look at Mataki. interesting vision foresight projection okay and Matakiti is a visionary seer psychic ability in time past okay so it's about leaving behind so for this I get the sense of are you seeing the past which you need to leave behind? So what's ha? Huh? Breath, energy exchange, distribution, and being present. Ah. This is interesting because here you've got the sense of the past, the ancient knowledge coming in as a seer using your psychic abilities to be able to yeah this is definitely about the knowledge the ancient knowledge the past and this is with the sense of the psychic ability using your psychic abilities or your intuition your sense of vision if you like to be able to to breathe breathe within breathe without breathe energy exchange to be able to live in the presence i think it's very important here um having a vision about where you want to be and what you want to do but it's very important to sort of live in the now be in the now is what i'm getting with this here I feel like this sense of letting go of the past letting go of the past could read it as letting go of the past and being able to to be able to um just be in the now be in the now um it can also be used about using your your i do feel like it could be also i'm getting a layer here where you've got the sense of your psychic abilities okay your psychic abilities to um to see the past to be in the past all the time and that can be um really tricky instead of being in the now it's a reminder to breathe um when you're using your psychic abilities to not get too wound up in the past to acknowledge the past is really important to acknowledge it and to learn from it but being in the now is super important as well being in the now so many layers to these three cards here okay but i do feel like there's a lot about the chaos so you've got to be sensing um letting go of the past so you can be in the now okay so let's have a look at your affirmation card from the songs of my heart by hand me that pencil so what card are we going to focus on here I devote time to laughter, allowing myself to laugh, to feel joy and happiness are key habits for my mental wellness. See, again, you get that sense of being in the present. Feels like this week is just so chaotic and so crazy. You've got to take time to sort of slow down, take a breath and breathe and just have a little bit of fun here. I think it's super important. Have a little bit of fun. Have a little bit of laughter. Allow yourself that moment to just uh, let go of all the chaos. Let go of all the stress and stuff going on. Um, the stuff that you're bringing in from the past, maybe. So there's a lot of stuff that just needs to, to allow yourself to be calm, be relaxed. Super important there. Okay, so that's the week ahead message. I'm just getting so many layers with... You know your intuition and you you know trusting your intuition being in the now and i know it can get 
when you're um, dealing with past stuff that's going on and the future stuff that's happening is being a seer or being a psychic here you know having psychic abilities it's so important to sort of allow yourself to just be in the presence to be in the now be in this moment super important here so having a little bit of fun is going to be very valuable to this week have a bit of laughter this week okay that's it from me don't forget to check the links down below check the links on my channel like subscribe and ring the bell so you know when the next video will be uploaded take care and blessed be